All right, hello everyone, and welcome back to our Minecraft five? video series detailing Crafted Nations, a server which we're doing. And Crafted Nations is basically a division. It's sort of a na nation setting in the overworld, in which it's divided into four nation, four countries. Um, this has been damaged some, but anyways. Um, each of which gets uh, one fourth of the map, and and they're free to build whatever they want, however they want in their areas. They're like the leaders are in charge of that. And, as long as it's not a threat to the enemy. Yeah. So that, and that's how it bases for wars and stuff too. So this is the initial spawn point of Crafted Nations. The spawn in here, and from this point, you're in a spawn zone basically, where it's basically a community area, project area. So, like, there will be a lot, there's, um, well, yeah, I guess, I guess I'll just show you. So, out this way, we have a Christmas tree, which was built for the Christmas celebration last year. Can you believe it? Yeah, um, we weren't there at the time, so, oh, that's Bursive. He's, he's me. Anyways, um, He's so from yeah. Record Breakers. Yeah, he's from the Northern Nation. Me, Pavish, and Mole Man. And uh, Lucas Digia. And Lucas Digia, but anyways. Paul, me, and Brenner, Brenner's mole man, Hi. are all from the southern nation, and we're, that's where the team recording is. So this is um, an iron trench designed by Tango Tech. So, and, um, so check and out Tango Tech's uh, videos no, 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 and hey, channels stop. and stuff. No, that's not what I'm doing. I'm saying this is his, the iron farm design that... And, and basically, this is a... Largest iron farm design in Minecraft as of right now. So, and we managed to build that with the help of probably eight or so people, including me. So yeah, so that and that enabled us to build some pretty cool iron base projects, which you'll see in the next video. Yes. So, <laughs> special thanks to Baybrin. That's me. More Marlton, uh, whatever. Halo is our uh, Megan, Micklor, Pobish. That's Trigger Happy, Dagon, he's the admin, and Mole Man. Uh, that's me! Yeah, that's him. Zombies. Undead Grave Digger. I don't know, even... okay. So, anyways, that is the Iron Trench. It's kind of laggy here. By Taco so, Tech. Tango Tech. Yep. Versus, <laughs> like, jumping off buildings right now. Okay. And over here. <laughs> Yeah, this, is, this is pretty lazy. I think I might need to read that. Anyway, this is a little fountain there built by... There is a fountain that Megan built. The it's fountain basically, of youth. Well, unfortunately not. It, um, you know, I guess I'm going to show you that. So here we have for mm -hmm. Team TBA... Oh, nice! They have a list on here. Let's see. Ah, alright. So oh, there's yeah, the amazing. members of that. And Redstone Republic, which That's is us. our nation. I need some chicken here, quick. And a lot of people lost. <laughs> this is Ender Sender, Nuclear, um that guy on the top left there. Players now. This is so this is um, only two people who are active. Yeah. And this is North, the most active and longest running nation. Anyway, and that's also Dagon. Right there. Dagon Wano is the Administrator of the server. I was going to point out earlier. This is the spawn lodge, kind of just like a safe right, house, Marlton. basically. Marlton. Yeah, Marlton yeah. built it. Guys, stop. Sorry. Calm down. Anyway, so that's this place. It's basically just, um. Okay. Yeah, this is so lazy. I'm going to be Alright, hold on. I'm just going to log out and back in. Okay. That's a little better. Alright. So yeah, it's basically just a place where new people can like just get started and there's a the rules here. Free and food. Free food, yes. Free I, I love the free food, I take it like every day. So yeah. And now this is one of the biggest additions to spawn area. This is spawn town. And you can pause it and read it if you really want to. But basically what it is is these land plots that it's still kinda of like that anyone can build a house or anything on, really. And it's kind of 
makes it so we have a place to do. Oh gosh, that's a creeper. And it kind of just makes it so we have a place where we can do some community projects. And this is my house. And I need I, I needed iron at the time. So whoa, what is this? That's person. I didn't see that. Before. Anyways, so yeah, and then this. Pet, big pet what store. is that? That's matches. Wow, I didn't see that before. Yeah, it was like this morning or something. That's that's way more than his fair share. Of I know land. it is, but he's a nation leader. Oh, what that's are we gonna do point. about it? Yeah, yeah. I suppose you get bigger ones. Maybe too. nation leaders can get bigger. Yeah, well, Jerry Ann is a big one too. I, I'm not sure. She has two plots. Okay. Anyways, so, and then down here is Market Street, which is where the shops are built. This is a animal pet store, basically. That's um, meowsers. <laughs> There's a skeleton on top of your house, but it's on. Cool. Um, Paul built his house here before we really decided on it being at Market Street. <laughs> and then, here's my um, house. <laughs> yes. And here's my melon farm, melon supply farm. It, it works perfectly, but oh, it's actually gone for a while now, so that's good. Um, Brenner's me um, not melons, <laughs> potion shop. So. With an E. Uh, and there's lots of people. That is weird. Um, I'm just gonna go around him. Should I kill him? Yes. And Should I kill a creeper? It, well, that's always a good thing, I guess. So. And here is. Oh, that's the sign. Yeah, no! Don't go up. Oh, gosh. You got oh, me. zombie. Is that really happening? I got one with it left Dang, on the creeper. Burning. Okay, now we're gonna see. Okay, so this is the. What is it called again? Cabana de Spawn. First of all, many cabins coming soon. Welcome so. to Cabana oh. de Spawn! Have, have some cookies. What? Cookie, 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 cookie. Yeah. Hey, you want, some, you want an axe too? So, since, axe. hey, since you're so willing to give us stuff, why don't you tell us about this place? This is a place. Hey, get out of that room! You haven't paid for that. Like get out of that room! <laughs> get! 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 It gets, it gets, it gets. Okay. Ah, top spilling. Yeah. So, uh, you want to tell us what this is all about? Well, this is also known as Ripoff Palace. It's not that new because half the room. Ripoff Palace, did yeah. you say? Uh, we charge 10 lapis of zoo, which is very rare, per night. And then, if you want to stay in a deluxe suite for half a night, it's 20. <laughs> is it so awesome? <laughs> By the way, if you punch me now, I'll probably die so you can do it. <laughs> okay, so. This place uh, is, yeah, it's called Ripoff. Oh, and anybody cares. Oh. Town of Ripoff. <laughs> oh, zombie. Anyway. Oh, you want that pickaxe? What? Pickaxe? Here. Here you go. Oh, I don't need a diamond. Well, take it. Sure. So anyways, this Ooh, is the Market needed... Street, and this area, we're not really sh It hasn't really been decided what it's going to be for. Um, how, yeah, mini game. Well, mini games are up ahead. Here I have a chessboard which I built, and I haven't gotten the pieces yet ready for that, but I'm going to. And then if you stay along the road. Hang on, like If you stay along the road here, you'll get to our mini game plot, and this I'm is being. Oh, it's first This is the area is being constructed for the one year anniversary of Craft of Nations. The server's been running for almost a year now, on October thirtieth. And we're going to have like a big celebration or something and stuff. And I'm bringing the cake. Oh, okay. No. Well, whatever. And then there will be a lot of mini games here that we that everybody can do and stuff like that. There will also be a flagpole here too. So, and uh, this is going to be my plot here. It's going to be some castle any... siege mini game. Oh, is there any on? Um, is there any big ones for parkour ones? Uh, there. I think all the biggest ones have been taken, but there's still some good size ones left. Ten by eighteen and ten by. Oh, so yeah, if you want to claim a plot, now you can. Plot. Is this ten by? What is that big one? Yeah. The biggest one. There, right, one right. Ten by twenty-five. That's pretty good size. That'd be a good size for parkour. What are the biggest ones? Ten by thirty. Oh, versus is right across from you, Paul. Anyways. So that's most of spawn. This is also where the fireworks show oh, on for the Fourth of July. Parkour oh. Palace. Okay. This is also where the fireworks show is on for the Fourth of July. 
Unfortunately, we missed it. yeah, we missed it, but it, it sounded like it was pretty cool. I think there's a YouTube video for it somewhere. You search Minecraft Craft of Nations and you'll probably find it. Dagon. Yeah, 1 0. Dagon 1 0. Day. Anyways. Dagon. And squid. You said what happened this one. And that is a observatory that I built for just sort of looking around the spawn area because every spawn point needs an observatory. And so yeah, that's about all the spawn point here and stuff that's in it. Do you want? I mean, I mean, um, um, Brenner, call this spot right here because it's unclaimed. It is. Yeah, just claim it. <laughs> you, I don't have a sign. Brenner, here, take the sign. So oh, yeah. Wait, what? So that's oh, about it. Oh, ten by twenty-five. There's all those other ones. Why? He, has, he can have a different one. Well, anyways, guys, we're still doing a video here. Oh, we are. Sorry. Okay, so anyways, that's about it for the spawn town, so, and all the spawn points, so I hope you guys have enjoyed watching our videos. Spawn town! And next time, hopefully, we will have a in-depth look at Maroon Station. Spawn town! So, thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time. Spawn